Hi, it's Tom from MyCare Eyewear, bringing you an evidence-based perspective to behavioural vision care. And today I'd like to talk about our infection control measures and why this is so important and how you can help us keep other patients safe. At Eye Care Eyewear, we believe it is our responsibility to our patients and to our community to use measures to minimise the risk of transmission of infection. Now, this is currently of paramount importance due to the anticipated impacts of COVID-19. It's worth mentioning that many optometry practices like Eye Care Eyewear have also carefully considered infection control when it comes to the types of equipment that we use to test your eyes. For example, the majority of our patients use our Tonoref pre-testing machine, which uses non-contact tonometry or a puff of air onto the surface of your eye to establish your eye pressure. From an infection mitigation perspective, this is far superior to the use of traditional devices such as probes that need to touch the surface of your eye. At Eye Care Eyewear, our infection control guidelines include regular hand washing between patients, we have sensor taps and paper towel dispensers at our double practice to reduce the possible transmission of infection from handling the taps. We also provide our staff with the opportunity to have regular vaccinations. And where possible, we use single use instruments and equipment. And this includes needles and burrs and for ocular foreign body removal and rust rings. We store and dispose of contaminated waste appropriately. When we use items that come in contact with patients, we use appropriate methods of infection control and the application of more rigorous procedures for individuals that are known to be infected or potentially immunocompromised. For example, we use alcohol sprays to disinfect surfaces that are frequently touched by us or by our patients. For our optometry equipment that comes in contact with people's eyes, we disinfect it by soaking in 0.5% chlorine solution. We also provide information to patients regarding infection control procedures for recommended treatment options. For example, we provide our contact lens patients with detailed information and video tutorials about how to safely use their contact lenses. We are all part of the solution in reducing the spread of infection. So please let us know if you have recently returned from any country affected by outbreaks of COVID-19 or if you've been in contact with somebody that has been a confirmed case of COVID-19. Symptoms can appear two to 14 days after exposure. So also let us know if there have been any symptoms suggestive of COVID-19, including fever, respiratory symptoms, cough or problems breathing, fatigue and muscles, or headaches. As per the recommendations provided by the Royal Australian and New Zealand College of Ophthalmologists, we recommend that if you fall into either of the above mentioned categories, that you, we postpone your examination for a couple of weeks. So please don't be alarmed if you see us cleaning frames and chairs and equipment a little more vigorously. And our forward apologies if our welcome doesn't feel quite as warm without my customary handshake. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel to see more of our videos. Comment down below if you have any questions about topics you'd like to hear more about. Thanks for watching.